Let's talk about the Warriors. I mentioned them at the top two. They brought their own version of anarchy last <laughs> night with the Villanova rookie, 41st overall pick, best friend of Donovan Mitchell, which I love. A little detail about this guy. Eric Pascal, 34 points to take down the Trailblazers on his 23rd birthday. Even staff excited from afar. Pascal said post game he was ready for the opportunity. I mean, I feel like I've been underrated my whole life. And uh, just this opportunity is amazing. I mean, it's not, not a lot of times where a rookie gets to play 40 minutes against the Trailblazers, Dame and CJ. So that to see that and give it that opportunity, you just got to try to make the best of it. You know, I just told Eric the only guy who can keep Eric under 20 is Jay Wright. So... <laughs> Kerr, of course, uh, talking about Villanova coach Jay Wright. Um, Wendy, what is – is he like the next Warriors undiscovered gem? They well, do they, this all the time. They hope so. Um, you know, the Warriors have pivoted. They realize that this season is now going to be about development. And I, I wouldn't be surprised if you see them, mo when they get the opportunity to make some moves, maybe look to move some of their veteran players who were going to be role players to make room for more young guys. And they have some other guys who they – Who are you saying they're getting rid of? Well, Alec Burks, uh, Willie Cauley Stein are guys, I think, after <laughs> December 15th. Tracy's like, crazy. get him out. <laughs> um, but this is not what they're doing. And so here's the, here's the amazing little sweet spot that they're in. They know that they're getting their stars back. Right. They haven't had a lottery pick since 2012. Now, that's a good thing. That's something to brag about. But they also haven't been able to replenish their young players. One of the reasons why they're so thin is because they haven't had a stock of young players to replenish it. So... Um, the idea here is to find, you know, last year they had, I talked about this before, they had Kendrick Nunn sitting on their G League. Mm. They couldn't get him. I, I don't have a problem. Mm. They had to sign uh, Andrew Bogut with their 15th roster spot because they needed him to compete right. for the championship. Yeah. They just, they couldn't, they couldn't hold on to Kendrick Nunn. So this year they don't want to miss the opportunities to get a guy who could help. Not to be the replacement for Kevin Durant, but to be a role player that they're, that they're lacking on right Did now. Did you like watching this kid last night? Listen, I... Before this kid had 34 or whatever he had last night, I told my brother, I was watching Golden State play. I said, I like that Pascal kid. Like, he was just showing me flashes. Yep. I told him I like this kid a lot. And he was like, nah. So last night watching on a plane, I was like, man, I knew I seen something. He just <laughs> need the opportunity. I text Bob right away. I say, yo, I really like this kid, man. And he was just basically telling me he's not afraid. Hmm. Right? When, when you got a, a rookie like this, I mean, he's big, physical, strong. Yeah, he strong. plays very, he, very he, strong. He very plays physical. strong. And he's not afraid to take mid-range jumpers. <laughs> and they won the game last night taking mid-range jumpers. Imagine I, that. I, I, yeah, I, mean, I, I really, really like this kid. I, I think he has a bright future. There's some good rookies. Yeah, really good, good rookie really class good, this year. Really yes. good rookie class. I like, by the way, when Trace says, you know, I text Bob. Bob Myers, the GM of the Warriors, who is your former agent, oh who you God. can just be like, eh, whatever. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.